Hello and welcome to the fabulous Yas Marina circuit here in Abu Dhabi, the location for this year's Young Driver Test. Over the next two days, we'll go behind the scenes as we watch the teams put the next generation of potential Formula One drivers through a series of tests to uncover the next superstar. Ask any of the team principals whether outright speed is the sole requirement, and they'll tell you that consistency, feedback and attitude are equally important. Still a few record times wouldn't hurt a driver's chances of securing a seat for next season. And right on cue, the first engine of the day has fired into life right below my commentary box. So I think we'll soon see a car out on track. Hey, good to see you again. As your race engineer, it's my job to support you this weekend. When you're out on track, we'll remain in contact via radio. I'll feed you information as and when you need it. As discussed in the team briefing, we're not looking for outright speed to begin with, so just take your time. Follow my instructions and you'll do great. I'll just check the lads are ready. We'll attach comms when you're in the car. OK, let's get you strapped in. That's right, boys. Well, the video that I am actually uploading, we are here in Yas Marina for the pre-season bit of my driver career. All right, so don't mind me as I just fix my settings. As you can see, I am playing on keyboard, so I'm going to be really ass and just dog shit. But, you know, it is what it is. We're here to have fun, and that's what really matters. Am I right, boys? So, yeah. Uh, I didn't really get a lot of votes on my poll I did. And I was enjoying playing F1 2012. So, I was like, fuck it. Might as well just play F1 2012. Why not, you know? It just makes more sense to do that. You know, because if you want to run a consistent channel, that's what you gotta do. You wanna do stuff you like. Anyways, I have some huge plans. We're going to be working from the bottom and trying to get up to like Ferrari or the Red Bulls. You know, for a game made in 2012, the graphics really aren't that bad. I am going to be using some assists. Okay, hate on me all you want. You can suck my balls, mate. As uh, Kevin Magnuson would say. Okay, let's run through the basic controls and ensure the guys have set the car correctly so that you're comfortable. First, let's check that the accelerator and brake pedals are a good fit. Great, let's check the steering lock next. Move the wheel from left to right for me. Next up are the gears. The box is either manual or automatic, but you can override the auto at any time by using the gear up and down controls. Pull the right paddle to go up a gear, and the left paddle to come down. I'll be using automatic. Okay, everything looks good. We're going to do a simple straight line aero run first. Let me know when you're ready to head out. Alright, let's go boys. Straight line test. Easy. All set. I'll be skipping the videos, so don't worry about that. You have to suffer as much as I have to. Okay. Before we start, I want to let you know that you can change the camera position by pressing the change camera button. Try cycling through them until you find the one you like. If you want to change your camera or assists, you can do it from the pause menu whenever you want. The first test is a simple straight line aero test. Head down the track, accelerating past 160 miles per hour, then brake so that you come to a complete stop in the designated area. The engine is locked to lean, so it's down a little on power at the moment, but it'll give us a consistent reading. Right. Let's go. Try and minimize our steering to gather up as much speed as possible. As quickly as possible. Break near the 200 meter board. data and you're on the brakes at just the right time. Right, 
Racing 101 video, I'll skip that. Here we are, boys. For this test, we need you to accelerate towards the hairpin corner, turn in at the correct point, hit the apex, and accelerate past 185 miles per hour out of the corner. We need you to stop in the designated area at the end of the straight to complete the test. Alright, get a good start there. Break over here, turn in. Let the car move in. low downforce on this car, Jesus. Freezes the game apparently. Well, it's been working. Oh, there you go. So let's remember, keep in mind, a very low downforce setup. Like a tire we did basically. Use the control. Hit the flashback button. Perfect. Let's go. Nice one. We got some good data. Your line and corner speeds are good. Baseline performance test. Complete. We're ready. Stringing together a couple of corners. Turn in so you hit the corner's apex and get oh on the gas loop. early as you exit. It'll be against the clock so this time, so we turn the engine up to normal. We need you to Let stop the in the designated rest. area at the end of the straight to complete the test. So nearly caught that apex. Just a matter of acceleration now. Metal, nice. nice one. We got some good data. Your line and corner speeds are good. We unlocked the three worst teams, which are the only teams that we're picking from. Alright, that's end of the first day. I skipped the video for and you. And that's so the end of day one there. of the young driver's test here at Abu Dhabi. Join us tomorrow Let's for move day on two. To day two. Good morning. Good morning. No, I'm I just hope you're feeling refreshed. Sorry, Jeff. Ready. I think that's your name. Okay. Before we start, I want you to perform a quick systems check for Kurs and DRS. Press and hold the Kurs button for me, please. Dude, Great. Oh, now try it's activating the DRS. Press it legend. once to open Rest it, and a peace. second time to close it. Alternatively, you can press the brake Anyways. to close it. Okay, you've got a car ahead of you who looks to be practicing their race start. I want you to use both your curves and DRS to try and overtake them before you cross the finish line up ahead. Whatever you do, don't collide with them. Good luck. <laughs> Brilliant! You used the Curs and DRS to good effect and were able to pass the car. We are not Toro Rosso, but does not matter. Okay, you've got three cars ahead of you. Use your Kurs and DRS to get to the finish line after the chicane, ahead of all of them. Don't make contact with any of them, however. Right, we no want contact. clean passes. Right. Oh, shit. No, I'm not really retarded. I was just pressing the wrong buttons. I'm... So You've got three cars ahead of you. Use your Kurs and DRS to get to the finish line after the chicane, ahead of all of them. Don't make contact with any of them, however. We want clean passes. Activated. 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 Activated.
this car so far. Should be good. Like three times I want already. you to drive the last Keep sector of the lap and hit every wire. apex. Braking distances are increased in the wet, and the tyres will break traction sooner, so be careful when you exit corners. Slow down for first. Left turn, 90 degrees, go in, past apex, no brake. Go in, release the bottle, hit apex, brake, 90 degrees, right turn, hit apex, slow down, 90 degrees, uh, left turn, another 90 degrees, left turn, double left hander there, on through second, double left hander, slow down, we totally clipped the apex, dude. Guess we'll just instant replay. Take control of car, double left hander, slow down. Just wait on the brakes there. Test boys. Engine. Okay, it's been a great couple of days. The final thing we want you to do is experience a race start and perform the first lap. When the lights go out, pull away and drive the lap using all the techniques you've learned so far. We'll be timing you, so give it your all. The engine is dialed up to give Let's maximum power. Watch me. Enjoy Watch it. Me. Set one minute lap, sub one minute. Let's go.
I say? What can I say, and bro? End of day two like of the young driver's test. Next time we see you, it'll be on the grid for the start of the okay. new I Formula One season. A. Until then, Come on, goodbye. Bro. I unlocked every team. Look at me go. Yeah, let's go, dude. Let's fucking go. Finally. But well deserved, I'll be honest. So yeah, um have a hue that we unlocked the helmet and all. I actually have a mod I downloaded. I'll put the link in the description. Um, I got these cool helmets that for different different teams. There's the Ferrari helmets, Red Bull helmets, etc. You get the memo, you can look through them. But that's gonna be it, boys. I have a podcast coming out sooner or later. The next episode will probably be out tomorrow, actually. Or day after tomorrow. Uh, yeah, peace out. Cheerios, whatever British people say.